Hi folks, um, I'll try as best as I, as I can to ensure that this video is stable. Um, it's a quick video on how to resolve the issue if you have it on your Windows 10 where the Bluetooth icon is missing in the in the system tray. See this system tray here? Um, I didn't find that Bluetooth icon there, it was missing. And then if I go to device manager, somebody said to go to device manager, um, I went to device manager and um, it wasn't showing me the option to turn on or to turn off the Bluetooth. Um, was that the device manager I meant? Um, sorry, the Bluetooth, the settings where you have the Bluetooth. Let me quickly go there. Yeah, so this this place where you have the Bluetooth and other devices in the setting. You see this option for turning on? I didn't have it before it went off. I just couldn't find it and I didn't know what happened. So what did I do to fix it? I read a lot of things online that talked about um, different things, but they weren't working. I wasn't saying this. So what I eventually did uh, quickly, I went to, you just go to your device manager. To go to device manager, I just quickly do Windows. You press the Windows button, Windows button and X together. And then I go to the device manager or just use your settings in your, in your um, laptop. In the device manager, um, right there, you, see, you can see that. You can see all of these options. Sorry, I'm doing this video in, a, in an old way, but this is the best way I can capture it now because I, I have to rush out and do some other things. But this would help somebody. Uh, by the way, if this video helps you, please subscribe to this channel for more more videos i do a lot of videos that can help people on different things on autos on cars how you fix some things how you get to discover some things in your car uh different things that can help you like do it yourself just please subscribe to the channel click like and then share the video as well so that it can help other people thank you so on the in the device manager you can see here this bluetooth it shows here I wasn't seeing that but if you don't see that what you do is go to view you can see show hidden devices just click that you will see Bluetooth there so expand it expand Bluetooth expand it when you expand it you see all of these things listed here so you see all of them this EP650 is 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 my headphone is my Bluetooth headphone and then you see YY Max that's my phone so i connected each time i need to connect my headphone or my phone to the laptop to do things i connect the bluetooth so i had about three or four bluetooth items here the me phone you see that as well so what i did was to right click each of these devices connected to the laptop right click and then you uninstall uninstall each and every one of them uninstall all of the devices connected to the laptop so when i was done uninstalling all of them so the only things i had left were the things related to the bluetooth itself which if i do like view by device type you can see okay that view by i do view by devices view devices by container okay that's still not showing me the different options but one minute i'll just show you that so that it can help you view by devices by connection okay i think this would show us yeah so see all of them maybe this is still the same as well but so all of this will now disappear because you have deleted all of those separate or different devices that you're connected that are connected to the lap laptop itself but then you'll have these other remaining things which are for the laptop itself which are the components of the bluetooth on the laptop on the windows um, laptop itself this is windows 10. so when you have them then close that Close that device manager once you have uninstalled them close that device manager and and i can tell you in fact immediately you should see this icon here and when you click it to open the bluetooth um, menu you should see that bluetooth turn on but if you don't uh, proceed restart your computer when you restart it you should see it uh if you at that point if you don't see it i'm afraid then i don't know what else you can do I just tried this out now this morning and it worked for me and you should be able to get going again with your bluetooth thank you please once again subscribe to this channel for more updates on different things i i post things on how to fix some things on phone 
how to fix some things in car different cars like audi um chevrolet um chevrolet anything i find out even on different areas of of life as well that can help you generally even if it doesn't help you you can see somebody else that it would help if you share it if this helped you kindly subscribe to this channel please to encourage me i i love every one of you guys thank you have a great day bye